Chinese obituary for Sima Qian. Sima Qian, 幺四五八六 B.C. was a Chinese historian during the early Han Dynasty. He is considered the father of Chinese historiography for his records of the Grand Historian, a general history of China covering more than 2,000 years, beginning from the rise of the legendary Yellow Emperor and the formation of the first Chinese polity to the reign of Emperor Wu of Han, during which Sima wrote. As the first universal history of the world as it was known to the ancient Chinese, the records of the Grand Historian served as a model for official history, writing for subsequent Chinese dynasties and the Sinosphere in general until the 20th century. Weiqi died c. 86 B.C. after 91 B.C. Hong Ziquan, Hong Xiuquan, Hong Ziquan, the 1st of January 1814 to the 1st of June 1864. Born Hong Huoxiu and with the courtesy name Ring Kun, was a Chinese revolutionary and religious leader who led the Taiping Rebellion against the Qing Dynasty. He established the Taiping Heavenly Kingdom over large portions of southern China, with himself as its Heavenly King. Weiqi died the 1st of June, 1864, age 50. Karl Marx, Karl Marx German, the 5th of May 1818 to the 14th of March. 1883 was a German-born philosopher, political theorist, economist, historian, sociologist, journalist, and revolutionary socialist. His best-known works are the 1848 pamphlet The Communist Manifesto with Friedrich Engels and his three-volume Das Kapital 1867 to 1894. The latter employs his critical approach of historical materialism in an analysis of capitalism. In the culmination of his intellectual endeavors, Marx's ideas and their subsequent development, collectively known as Marxism, have had enormous influence on modern intellectual, economic, and political history. Weiqi, the 14th of March, 1883, age 64, London, England. Charles George Chinese Gordon. Major General Charles George Gordon, C.B. the 28th of January 1833 to the 26th of January 1885, also known as Chinese Gordon, Gordon Pasha, and Gordon of Khartoum, was a British Army officer and administrator. He saw action in the Crimean War as an officer in the British Army. However, he made his military reputation in China, where he was placed in command of the ever victorious army, a force of Chinese soldiers led by European officers, which was instrumental in putting down the Taiping Rebellion, regularly defeating much larger forces. For these accomplishments, he was given the nickname Chinese Gordon and honors from both the Emperor of China and the British. Weiqi, the 26th of January, 1885. Aged 51, Khartoum, Madia Sudan, Yuan Shikai, Yuan Shikai, 16 September 1859 to the 6th of June 1916 was a Chinese general and statesman who served as the second provisional president of the Republic of China, head of the Bian government from 1912 to 1916, and emperor of China from 1915 to 1916. A major political figure during the late Qing Dynasty, he spearheaded a number of major modernization programs and reforms, and played a decisive role in securing the abdication of the Xuantong Emperor in 1912, which marked the collapse of the Qing monarchy and the end of imperial rule in China. Weiqi died the 6th of June, 1916, aged 56. John Rabe, John Heinrich Detlef Rabe. The 23rd of November 1882 to the 5th of January 1950 was a German businessman and Nazi Party member, best known for his efforts to stop war crimes during the Japanese Nanjing Massacre, also romanized as Nanking, and his work to protect and help Chinese civilians during the massacre that ensued. The Nanking Safety Zone, which he helped to establish, sheltered approximately 250,000 Chinese people from being killed. He officially represented Germany and acted as senior chief of the European-U.S. establishment that remained in Nanjing, the Chinese capital at the time, when the city fell to the Japanese troops. Weiqi, the 5th of January, 1950, age 67, West Berlin, West Germany. Anna Louise Strong, Anna Louise Strong, the 24th of November, 1885 to the 29th of March, 1970, was an American journalist and activist. Best known for her reporting on and support for communist movements in the Soviet Union and the People's Republic of China, she wrote over 30 books and varied articles. 
from 1962 to 1966. Strong published letters from China in which she and other U.S. expats in China praised Chinese socialism. Partly from fear of losing her passport should she return to the U.S., she settled permanently in China until her death. Wiki, the 29th of March, 1970, age 84, Beijing, China. Bruce Lee. Li Xiaolong, Doha. The 27th of November. 1940 to the 20th of July, 1973, was a Hong Kong American martial artist and actor. He was the founder of Jeet Kune Do, a hybrid martial arts philosophy drawing from different combat disciplines that is sometimes credited with paving the way for the combat sport mixed martial arts, MMA. Lee is considered by some commentators and martial artists to be the most influential martial artist of all time and a pop culture icon of the 20th century, who bridged the gap between East and West. He is credited with promoting Hong Kong action cinema and helping to change the way Chinese people were presented in American films. Wiki, died, the 7th of July 20, 1973, age 32. Who the Abu Terfibu? Who the Abu Terfibu? The 23rd of April, 1989, also known by her English name Butterfly Wu, was a popular Chinese actress during the 1920s and 1930s. She was voted China's first movie queen in 1933, and won the Best Actress Award at the 1960 Asian Film Festival for her performance in Rear Door. Who Dai starred in Twin Sisters, Zima Ihua, director Zheng Zhangqiu, in 1934 in which she skillfully played the double role of twin sisters with very different personalities. The film was not only extremely popular but also won critical acclaim. It is generally considered her best film. Wiki, died, the 23rd of April, 1989, age 81, Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada. Rosalie Matilda Kuanghu Chou. Zhou Kuanghu, ER. September. 1917, or 1916 to the 2nd of November, 2012, was a Chinese-born Eurasian physician and author. 3. Better known by her pen name Han Suyin, Chinese. Han Suyin. She wrote in English and French on modern China, set her novels in East and Southeast Asia, and published autobiographical memoirs which covered the span of modern China. These writings gained her a reputation as an ardent and articulate supporter of the Chinese Communist Revolution. She lived in Lausanne, Switzerland, for many years until her death. Wiki died, the 2nd of November, 2012, age 95, Lausanne, Vaud, Switzerland.